Guys, we're back. Mahina, Nathan, back at the scary slab somewhere over there. Come down to check it. Another day of swell. Um, it's too low tide, but the swell looks like it's good. If you can't tell, then we'll just tell you right now we're freezing. Um, ben, the young Scottish laddie that we were surfing with the last few days, he's checking in another spot. It's gonna be working too. So there's definitely swell in the water, but we've kind of just been chasing tens after that last session we had out there, that big day we had out there. Uh, it was just psychotic. It was one of those sessions where you get into the water and you really, you, you realize right away that it's much bigger and more dangerous than you thought it was. The paddle out was a lot scarier. Just paddling in the, in the key hole. I couldn't even get my head above the foam. Every time to, so I had to stop, sit up to take a breath, paddle through foam for like 25 foot. Mahina thought it was hilarious, but when I was paddling it, I thought it was funny until <laughs> when I was paddling, I was like, this is a little spooky. And then we got out there, and the slab was freaking huge, huge, and so gnarly and so good. And just trying to learn a new way. Like, I was so much harder to position than we thought. Um, so we didn't get the one we wanted. To, I didn't get the one I wanted. I, had, I rode a few nice waves, uh, medium waves. One was deep, my smallest one was my deepest one. And then my biggest one, it wasn't super deep, but it felt good to ride them waves. But now I'm like hooked on trying to hunt this wave out here um, and get a real good, deep, big set. And today's the thing, I think I might be able to do it. Um, if not, that's that and we've enjoyed our trip in Scotland. As you guys have seen, it's been freaking insane and so pretty. Um, and we love the land here and the people and everything else about it we've done to exploring. I hope you can hear me. I don't know if this wind's doing something to the mic, but um, that's the update for now. <laughs> we are trying a new wave today. <laughs> we're the church from Tens. So we're going out to a different way. I laughed today. So it looks really good actually. You're changing to a 6 2, you said? Yeah, I just feel like it's been a little bit under on my board because once your hands and everything starts to freeze, it gets harder to paddle. Starting to get to him. <laughs> I thought I would be a man forever. <laughs> Booties. Check. Check. Check.
actually such a sick little setup and had the coolest little bend on it but I think the tide like we got to the tail end of when it was good because the probably good on a really low um, but the high tide was causing it to clamp into the channel but such a fun little wave and a couple of, just a couple of the local boys out and myself uh, trading off on some sets so and we finally got to go left we've only gone right this whole trip and uh, that was our first left search in Scotland so that's a good time. Um, now, the tide's getting high, so we're heading back to the slab because it was too low earlier. Uh, so we're gonna get eyes on it. We're staying suited up for farming yeast. Daily yeast farming here in Scotland. We have some of the best yeast in the world. <laughs> Stay in our suits, long, long hours. Uh, got some hot coffee to warm up. Having a, having a bit of trouble with the hands. The temperature has dropped dramatically in the last few days. Like. The wind is colder, the water is colder. When I first got here, it was totally fine. Served a few hours and my hands were fine the whole time. But uh, now uh, it's becoming a bit of an issue. I might wear gloves this sec. I think I'm gonna use them, but it's, I don't know. Gloves can also just be a weird thing to use because you can't get a close grip on your fingers and paddle. And so, whoa, this is me, I think. Um, but then your session's over when your hands freeze. Your hands freeze and your pinky gets, or your fingers start to extend and claw in like this. So paddling sucks. And when you're getting work, you're going to swim up and you're just clawing. Like you're not getting purchase on the water. So it's a little spooky. Uh, kind of a session ender when your hands get to the point of no return. So I'm gonna wear some gloves. Anyway, enough of the glove ramp. We'll see you at the slab. The high tide will be like a two hour window. Yeah, it doesn't look like this. Got a long way out, I'm a bit dry. Okay, we film for a little vlog thing. Oh, yeah. You're on the vlog. <laughs> Psyched. A new body order friend from Australia. Hello. Hey, how's it going? <laughs> Sick. We try not to.
closing down in. Yeah. I couldn't tell like on the set, so I was like nervous. It just looked difficult to make. Like, was the board too long or did the board feel fine? I saw. Yeah. That's what I thought. or you want to do it like this? Still haven't gotten the wave I wanted, but we tried. Fell on two bigger ones, but fell direction change. This wave is so difficult. Good time though. Had a good time surfing with the sky I just met. Uh, freezing cold, the gloves helped a ton. And then the wind came on shore. So, time to get my lovely life out of the cold. And then myself out of the cold and drink some hot coffee. Here we are, soaking wet. <laughs> I'm gonna start waving you. I was like, just go back in the car. Oh, is that what you were saying? Yeah. I thought you were telling me to move and I was yelling at you, I have the angle. <laughs> I was just like, just go through it. <laughs> I'm committed to my bikes. Oh, no. Check it. He got some sick ones. Scottish junior champ. <laughs> what? Legendary. Yeah. Congrats, buddy. Under, what was it? Under 14? <laughs> under 12. Oh, that's you. <laughs> yeah, Reptile like one Scotland. Under 12 as well. Oh, good job, you guys. Under 16. 16. <laughs> yeah, a bunch of champs, eh? Yeah. Another champ's going down. <laughs> 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 <laughs>